Are your rosebuds distorted in brown? Well, I can tell you how to fix that. Are your rosebuds distorted, have brown edges, or even fail to open? Then you've probably been visited by the Western Flower Thrift. By the time you see the damage, the Western Flower Thrift is probably gone. However, Western Flower Thrifts do carry viruses that'll affect other plants in your landscape, so you do need to take some action. Western flower thrips are attracted to light-colored roses, white roses, and fragrant roses, like this heavily scented red rose in my garden. By the time you see the damage, the western flower thrips are gone, and insecticides will not help. You can use a systemic insecticide before the rosebuds form. However, that'll kill beneficial insects and pollinators too. Systemic insecticides work by putting the solution on the roots and the plant uptaking it to the leaves and the flowers. So when a bad insect bites into a leaf and sucks the sap out, it'll die. But if a bee pollinates your roses, it'll die too. The best way to manage western flower thrips is through cultural control. Last year I had a heavy infestation of western flower thrips in my garden. As soon as I realized what was going on, I cut off all my roses and my rosebuds and deposited them in my trash, not my green waste. The second flush of roses were beautiful because most of the thrips are gone at that point, but there still were a few distorted, so I cut those off and threw them in the trash also. This year my garden is beautiful, and I only have two rose plants that are infected. I've cut off the rose buds and the flowers and have thrown those in the trash. Hopefully next year I won't have thrips at all. Cultural control includes removing debris and fallen leaves from your garden, watering at the base of your rose bushes, not the leaves, and attracting beneficial insects such as the green lacewing, which is a natural predator of thrips. Thanks for watching, and for more information about thrips, see the description box below. If you have a gardening question about thrips, or anything at all, contact your local Master Gardener office. We're here to help.